Good evening. Clean shaven. The beard's gone, as I promised. Hi, right, welcome to my channel, uh, CK9S. Uh, that's my new na channel name now, CK9S uh, Adventures. Um, it's going to be a few things uh, I'm going to be doing different. Um, there's something which is down here, two things down here. What I'm going to be doing over the next few months. Hopefully you'll come along on that journey. Um, it's going to be a really, really good adventure. Um, there's going to be camper van uh, stay overs. Uh, it's going to be just basic walks. Um, it's going to be bivy camps, tent camps. Could be people coming along with us to do them. Could be not. Could be dogs coming with us, and we'll see. So I'm going to show you what I'm going to be doing. That's what I'm going to be doing. I know there's one other person doing that at the moment. He's only done a few. But basically, this is what we cover. Um, we start from this area, which is the Southern Northumberland. What we call Southern Northumberland. Unbelievable, and it's funny. I just basically live there from Northumberland, so basically about nine mile to Northumberland. Um, and then basically, we've got this area up here. I'm gonna basically crack as much as these off as I can before I hit the major one. This is the major one where it's in dark. Uh, basically because it's a military area, military owned area, and you basically need permission, you need to check uh, before you go into that dark zone, which I'll be sending emails nearer the time. Um, to do all that, I've got the email address. So that, Roughly that area will be my last area um, before I finish this. There's 152 trick points or trick pillars or whatever they're called. Um, I'm going to be cracking on with them over the next year. I can say van camping, walking. Uh, bivy camping at some of them or tent camping. My other interest is becoming as I bring over to here is a Swiss Army knife. I've had like the cheapies and I've, you know the cheapies are uh, as you know cheap and shit. So I've gone with flake. I've started my collection with these two. This is basically a walker's knife. <laughs> Uh, I don't know why it's a walker's knife. Um, we don't know why it's got the saw on or anything like that. But basically it's got a knife, a saw. It's got a screwdriver, a cut, bottle opener. And it is, I'll close that down. You'll see there's a little notch in which is a wire cutter. Um, these are the dog's bollocks. The yard sharp. They have learnt me lesson. They're very sharp. Um, and this one is just a Swiss press as a Swiss Army knife. Um, I'm not. I can't remember if this is the Hunter's one or not. Uh, but these are very expensive. You've got a hook there. You've got a corkscrew. You've got the. Um, punch and so on you've got the knife main knife sorry mini knife um you've got a screwdriver bottle opener white cutter again got magnifiers got the scissors you've got a flip screwdriver again you've got can opener with a screwdriver on there and the main knife um i think i've already explained them in generally, same as all Swiss Army knives, you've got the toothpick and the tweezers. So, but I bought this book um, here. 
It's got 101 uh, tips, uh, tricks and uses of these knives. So basically you don't really need what I've read in here. You don't really basically need your big bushcraft knives. Um, you just basically need one of them. And now I'm going to take you on that journey to show you um, what you can do with them. And that's it. Basically on my channel. So if you want to follow me along on the new channel name, CK9S Adventures, you can. Um, not only will it be the trick bagging and the uh, Swiss Army knives, but there will be other camps with different people. Um, van camps and stuff like that. So thank you for watching. And hopefully we'll see you in the near future. See you soon.